produce today? What's that? What do you have for fresh produce today? <laughs> Nothing fresh. <laughs> Nothing fresh today? <laughs> Nothing fresh today. Yes, we have no bananas. We saw you in Middletown. I've seen you a couple times. Yeah. Always love I, seeing I, the I truck. around a bit. Always love seeing the truck, man. <laughs>
To that Silver City. Oh, you went down there. Oh, that's the second time I've been there. That's the I, I, I don't mind it. So we met someone there, and I asked him about it. Oh, yeah, we're going to get up in the boat over here. I go, 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 I
But to each their own. That's what the hobby is. So you know. Generator. That's what. Uh, yeah, it's a uh, uh, alternator. alternator. Looks like a, a, the uh, power gen, you know. Yeah. Power master. Wow, that's pretty. So everyone's good. If it's running, if the engine's running well, yeah, it ain't cylinder flatty, no problem. Yeah, I mean. It's not gonna overheat. It's not gonna. Well, you know, they if they have sure. problems with uh, with getting hot, just the way the engine is. But this has been, you know, they drove them 50 years, 60, 70 years ago. 50. So. How are we doing here? You want to sell the truck here? The car? Yeah. <laughs> the wagon. How did they drive it here with a driver? Look at this Yes, it is. You know what? I never thought of that, but it's just, it's backward. Yes. It's probably put it on the other side of the car. It's 55. You know what? That's a good You know what I'm saying? It's actually 55 back. The 210 had the, the single chrome, mm -hmm. and the Bel Air was the, was the loop, right? You just repeated everything. Okay. <laughs> I, just, I swear to God, 20 seconds ago I said this. Me too. I love that car. I like the, the 210s when they do the one thing, but the Bel Air with the thing in the middle is a little bit too much for me. Hold on, he's filming. No, you, I want to get you talking about it, man. Oh, yeah. That's the owner right there, this man. The only oh, old oh, Rotter TV. Are you Rotter TV? Yeah, it's me, bros. Thank you. No. <laughs> you guys are here, man. Hey. Yeah. Oh, it's a real dodge. One side and the other side. Okay. 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 Okay.
Sit down for your drive. Yes, yes, you can finish it up. Yeah, yeah do, do something. Do something make it. And they always like window decals, man. <laughs> a lot of them are original to the car. They've been on there for 20 plus years. This car come from Las Vegas? No, no. Uh, I think the car's been, though, prior to my ownership. Yeah. I like the. I got it. with the world. How you doing there? Good. You, you know, well, but, I, I, I did, you know, because, you know, and it's just like, and it, well, well, hey, you're doing your thing. Back in the work on the phone, and what back to the owner, and I got 500 bucks on that. And his car, his car is actually from Las Vegas. His car, I've seen his car off all the computer shit run like the 40s. Yeah. He it, right? And he runs in 1090 bucks. But he got real good at second all this shit, right? I went up with the
I think I saw some hay down a little bit on the other side. We didn't get out looking. Flamethrower El Dorado. Got the spark caressers back there. Yeah, my name is Joe, and you're looking at my 53 Hudson Hornet at the race car. How long have you owned the car, Joe? Uh, 10 years. 10 years? 10 years. Yeah. Where, did you, where, did you, where did you find the car? Up in New Hampshire. New Hampshire? Yeah. Right. yeah. I went to New Hampshire to buy a, a car to the Hudson that was advertised, and the guy had this one out in the back of his barn. Wow. So and I, it has a history. Yeah, well, yeah, it's, it originally is from Connecticut, but it ended up, at, through the Hudson Club, it ended up in New Hampshire. Right. And then I knew the guy that had the other car for sale, so when I saw this, I bought Here. That's one of the original Doc Hudsons. That, 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 it's not the original that was in the movies. But Paul Newman made the movies cars, yep. and they had the, the 53 Hudson Horner in there, the fabulous Hudson Horner. All right, let's talk about the, the engine here, Joe. What are we looking at? That's a 50, the 53 Hudson Hornet engine with the dual carburetor, twin H power, and they call it a 7X racing engine. Hudson made a 7X race engine only for racing at Daytona. And I, I happened to work for the dealer back in the 50s, and I bought a couple of those motors, and that's one of them. Now, how many horsepower would this have? This one here has got like 250 horsepower. That's excellent. Yeah, there's, there's no back seat in it because it's a race car. No radio. Got a big trophy back there or is it a bucket? No, that's a trophy. That's, trophy a, that's a piston cup trophy. We'll have to get a picture of it later yeah, on. Yeah, no, I, I usually take it out. I'll put it in front of the car. I like the air conditioner setup. How there. do you like that, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Bad reoperators. That's not quite very correct, but we'll let you cheat with that one. And it works, too. <laughs> Oh, no. Yeah, that's the picture of this this car. Yeah, yeah. And there's the insignia where, where it says cards, the movie cars, they had yeah. it on the back. I'm throwing him in my trunk, I'm bringing him on, I got a pile of them. Now, it's 
like there's vines everywhere that's growing. There's a doe out there. She's pulling on it. It's like seven feet long. And she's trying to pull it. We can get out of here. Daughter, my grandson. Guys. Still in the corner. Oh my goodness. He's just in there. He's battery out. Because they got it wet, it wasn't under warranty. It was $60,000 for the battery. So they got a six month old car that cost 80 grand with a three time. They got to put 60 grand in for it. My floor wind caught the light.
Oh. How you doing? All right. I'm not talking to yeah, so I used to just wear the whole music system. I'm not sure where the hot dogs are. Did I tell you that already? I have an appointment. It's powerful. It's muscular. It'll. 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 You hear it cracking? How loud is it? Come here. This tree away. Stories these two guys here just came up from Detroit. Detroit to the car show up here in Connecticut. 
Got a beautiful Etzel right here. That's cool, boy. They both came up from Detroit. That's a good ride, huh, Steve? I bet. Just a long ride. Apparently, there's uh, some other guys with us. I think so. Or they, but they left us several times. You want to talk to the guy? He's wearing a... Uh... Tall guy. Tall guy. Uh -oh. Kind of cool, huh? Yeah. And mine is five three zero. It starts with five three zero, so you know it's new. Okay, thank okay. you. Yep. Thanks very I'll do much. Later when we home. How you doing there? Good. That's kind of rare and unique. What are we looking at? I saw one of these at a, a car show when I was an eight-year-old kid. It was a Briggs and Stratton buckboard. Huh. And they're okay, they're just axles bolted to a springy board. Okay. Yeah. And. Well, uh, I have a 40-year-old lawnmower engine that's going to go on this eventually. But I saw it when I was a little kid, and I was so blown away, I've never forgotten it. That's how it happens, man. That's it. Ryan. It's been fun. I've been working on it for about a year. There is a club in America called, for cycle carts. And uh, they have a racing class, so I use the right engine and the right wheels. It fits in a racing class for American cycle cars. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Well. Okay. So, what is your first name? Ralph. Ralph. What are we looking at? What year? This is a 1958 Yeoman wagon. 58 Yeoman wagon. wagon. It's the cheapest one they made. They made about 12,000. Yeah, I was a, a little kid, and I saw one. A Yeoman wagon. Briggs and Stratton and a couple other different companies. You can open the hood up. I want to see the. I want to see the the engine compartment there. So back then, what, was, what would this car cost? Any was, guess? I think it was thirty twenty eight hundred. Yeah, there's a there's a cycle car club in America, and they have a racing club, and they all use the. I can honestly say I don't think I've ever seen a Yeoman wagon. No. On the other side, you notice this is you. There's hop-up shots. Stage two and stage three setups for them. Straight six? Oh yeah. In the racing class and the the wheel base. It's about 180 horsepower. See a guy in a Corvette with a new Corvette. He's going 80 miles an hour, which is weird, and I'm right behind him. <laughs> this is a bomb. They gotta go faster. Oh, nice. Can you work on the on the uh...
How you doing there, sir? Yes, sir. I like your lemon yellow car here. Truck. Free window. Very nice. It's lemon ice. Yeah, it's a lemon ice. Yeah. What year? Uh, 34. 34? Yeah. Say, dedicated. 